Hello my friends, uh, hope all is well with you. Uh, after the Brexit extravaganza, uh, and I will strongly believe that Brexit was, will be the best thing that's ever happened to the UK. You can already see the stock market going back to where it was uh, before uh, the Brexit was uh, confirmed. But this is not what I'm going to talk to you about today. Uh, I'm going to talk to you about uh, the Swedish police and uh, the chief of police, Don Eliasson, who now have done some countermeasures for the accelerating amounts of uh, gang rapes, sexual assaults, uh, rapes on kids, women, uh, gropings and stuff like that. Uh, we have had a massive boom here since the migration started in uh, September, August, September, October last year. And uh, it turned really bad at New Year's in uh, Cologne, as you all know. And after that, the debate here in Sweden has uh, turned quite rapidly. Uh, but as always, it's the victims uh, who gets the blame. And uh, you never actually get harder punishments for the rapist you get actually they get released but now finally uh, Don Eliasson the chief of police has come up with a brilliant solution to stop this from happening stop all the gang rapes stop all from the sexual assaults stop all the groping of young girls in public uh, and that brilliant new idea is a wristband made of rubber that says no groping, please. I shit you not, world. So, in order to prevent sexual assaults, to prevent women from getting raped, and prevent young children of getting raped, the police is handing out wristbands made of rubber that says no groping, please. Instead of uh, making chemical castration the only good punishment for rapists and pedophiles, uh, instead of uh, deporting criminal foreigners who are not even Swedish citizens out of the country instead they give women wristbands made of rubber I, I, I don't know what else to say but uh, this is what's going on in Sweden right now Except that we have a Prime Minister that uh, thinks that EU is a really good thing and that's why he will not let the Swedish people vote for a Swexit, so to say. Sweden's Jimmy Hoffa is not a Prime Minister, he's a gangster and he needs to get out of office ASAP. Enjoy the summer guys, bye.